I'm speaking on behalf of the Armenian Youth Federation. Um, our presence here today is something that's uh, a bit of a tradition. Uh, for many in the Armenian community, we've been gathering in front of this building since our childhoods, demanding justice from the Republic of Turkey uh, for the Armenian genocide and demanding reparations for that still unpunished crime. And our purpose coming to, to the consulate is not that different from why the rest of us are here today. Um, as we know, these attacks on minorities in Turkey today are not new. They are systemic and they are a part of a larger trend. What happened to us in 1915 happens today still to the Armenian community, to Kurdish communities, to minority communities, to the LGBT, to the left, and all people struggling for justice in Turkey. We are very fortunate to be able to stand here today in solidarity. Currently, we are not breaking any laws in the United States, but we have broken many in Turkey currently with our presence. Just speaking out against the government's crimes is enough to put us in danger of arrest and in danger of violence from ultranationalists. What the people that whose faces you see before you today, their demands were not radical or uh, outrageous. They simply demanded justice and the treatment of human dignity which are things that are luxuries and very, very rare for Armenian, Kurdish, and other communities in Turkey. To simply show that you are not necessarily Turkish can put them under danger. And we are here today using our privilege to gather here to highlight these issues. For Haranti, and Selak Balakchi especially, their families have gone to thousands of court trials demanding justice. The Turkish justice system is layered with obstacles for communities demanding justice. And our work here today gives light and it gives hope and it gives solidarity and strength to the people demanding justice every single day, either on the streets or in the courtroom, because it's a battle that is not easily won and it is hard fought. Um, this is. We want to say that this is not the, the end or the end result. We want to say that this is the beginning and we look forward to working in common cause with the Kurdish community and other communities in the Southern California area. And I want to end with um, a, a statement that is often said um, after Hrant Dink's murder and after um, the, the uprisings for justice uh, in response to these assassinations. We say we are all Hrant, we are all LG, we are still here. M. Hrantin, M. Elchine, M. Hezuvr. Menk Hrantin, Menk Elchine, Menk Hoseng.